Heavy metal fans had a roaring good time over the weekend as Metallica performed two shows at U.S. Bank Stadium. The M72 World Tour is an incredible production with more moving parts than you can imagine. What does it take to put on a major concert? Good question. Jeff Wagner got a behind the scenes look at the massive effort that had downtown rocking. Heavy metal worthy of the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame rumbled through U.S. Bank Stadium. As Metallica shredded and pounded through two energizing shows, an astounding production made possible by hundreds of hardworking people. And what we do in Minneapolis might not be the same that we, what we did in Chicago last week. John Michael Marino is the tour coordinator. How many people does it take to put this production together? It's a great question. Um, Metallica alone has a little over 150 crew. Add to that 40 steel workers, 168 local production hands, and 92 truck drivers, a band of four supported by more than 100 times that amount. How long does it take to put this together? So the tower system is about 36 hours of labor. There's eight towers, each weighing more than 14 tons and standing nearly 100 feet high. Once that's in, it's about another 12 hours to build stage video, audio, lighting on top of that. Is there anything in particular here that really blows you away? The sheer weight that's surrounding us is, is pretty mind-boggling. There's a tension system of about 20,000 pounds of cabling above our heads right now, and all of the speakers added together is about 120,000 pounds. It's enough to be considered the largest touring audio system ever. There's also 650 lights, 24 LED screens, and 37 miles of fiber optic cable connecting all of it. If you were to roll out all that cable, it would stretch from U.S. Bank Stadium all the way to Stacy, Minnesota. The amount of logistics and engineering that goes into a basic rock show uh, is pretty, pretty incredible. Speaking of rock show, we got to talk about the instruments, specifically the guitars and bass. There's 64 of them on the tour and 36 need to be show ready. Why do they need 12 each? You have to remember across the, let's call it 15, 16 songs, there's various tunings. Um, there's also things that happen naturally like strings breaking, guitars going out of tune that have to be swapped in the moment. Metallica is deservedly front and center, but it's the crew behind them who should also take a bow. In Minneapolis, Jeff Wagner, WCCO News. Uh, roughly 800 people are employed locally to support each stop on the tour.